my god, star pipes are really kind of broken. I mean, I wouldn't say they're broken, but they kind of do change the game. Just because, let's say you're playing with four human players that aren't stupid. If everybody has a star pipe or two people have a star pipe or something like that, you kind of aren't going to bother going after a star just because they can use the star pipe. I mean, especially the last five turns when, when they sell star pipes like up the ass. Like, it kind of just becomes a game of what? Well, it kind of becomes a game of just buying the star pipes. And if not, just like hoping the star appears right in front of you or something like that. But yeah, star pipes kind of do change the game. Because uh, look at this, the next star is going to appear right there, however... Okay, the next star appears right there, but... Uh, okay, how do I put this? The next star appears right there, but it's like... Everybody's going to get at least one turn to try to get to that star. If not, I'm just going to use my star pipe and pretty much change the uh, location of the star. So there's no real reason to... You know, kind of go after the star since it's probably just gonna, most likely gonna change places. All right, we got this mini game again. My God, this game's gonna leave me highlight headed. Okay, oh my God, could have sworn it was gonna land on me, but kind of always does that. Okay, so me and Mario are kind of neck and neck. Well, not really anymore, just because I got like 30 more coins in him. Okay, Luigi, please don't use your snack. Okay, you didn't. Okay, he, yeah, he got it. Yeah, he definitely got it. Okay, how many spaces did he have left to go? He had six, so... Please... Oh my god, are you serious, game? Oh, wow! Okay, never mind. Well, there goes all his money. Yeah, me, Mario, and Luigi are kind of neck and neck. Like, with three stars, there is like 10 stars out in the game right now. Man, that is the thing about Mario Party DS, if I haven't already said that, is that because the maps are kind of small, a lot of stars are actually going to be gotten. Or like, it, or it's a high, high star game. Which definitely makes those hex stars that uh, take away one or two stars kind of uh, dangerous. And what did he buy? He bought a star pipe, of course. And yes, the uh, star I believe is 10 coins right now, so I'm just going to use my star pipe. Buy that for 10 coins. Awesome. And now I am out of star pipes. <laughs> Alright, it's 15 coins, so Mario kind of has to win the next minigame. Okay, send me over there, please. Nope. I mean, it put me pretty close. Wario's probably gonna get there first. Alright, what minigame is this? Ooh, this one. Uh, balance your weight in the wire hanger to assist your partners as you zig through the uh, clothesline core shift left, shift left, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. It's a really. I like this minigame a lot. Yeah, for Mario Party 3DS, they should definitely bring back this whole uh, shrunken idea because they made a lot of really cool mini games with it. And of course, when you and your partner are in the center, you'll go faster. Ah, dang it. That was my fault. Okay, doesn't look like we're gonna win. Yep, 
Yeah, we lost. It was probably because I screwed us over there, but yeah, we lost. Ah, uh, okay, Mario. Okay, luckily for Mario, he didn't take the uh, star pipe. Because that's definitely what Luigi wanted from him. Actually, you know what? Okay, those are the rules. Mini game set. All mini games, computer difficulty. Yeah. Okay, I was actually looking there for an option to uh, view computer mini games because I don't think I'm gonna get a chance to land on that happening space right there, and I kind of wanted to show it off. Yeah, nobody's really close to that star right there. You know what, I'll give it to Wario. I mean, he's in last place, but also there's a uh, bonus star for the uh, friendship. Okay, I'll just call it the friendship star. Yeah, the friendship star. I'm gonna give it to War just because if the game comes really close where the bonus stars are actually gonna make a huge difference and the friendship star appears, I would rather have Wario get it because, you know, he doesn't have too many stars, so him getting it probably won't screw me over, but let's just focus on this minigame that we've already played. Okay, gonna... Okay, yeah, I definitely won again. Not gonna broke. Oh crap! Luigi, calm down, Luigi. Ah, dang it! Luigi came in there. Wow, I honestly thought I was gonna win there, but Luigi just came from behind and just took it. Oh my God, look at all those star hex that Luigi has. That is gonna be really scary. Man, this game is gonna get really dangerous later on. Like, I can already see that happening with all those star hex that people are putting down everywhere. And Wario's gonna change the star location. And puts it right behind me, so it kind of doesn't make a difference. Yeah, that kind of doesn't make a difference. I mean, it does put it a little bit more far away from everybody, but still not a huge difference. Alright, come on, give me a good roll. I want to get to the freaking store so I can buy some more dice blocks. Oh, uh, nice. Okay, I'm happy I get to show this off. Okay, this is the uh, happening space I was talking about. It uh, teleports somebody to where you're at if you land on it. And holy crap, 92 coins. Chief Chump. Okay, this one. Uh, survive the longest. Okay.
Okay, this minigame isn't too bad. Just, you just gotta keep an eye out on those chief chiefs. You can kind of use the top screen to help you out, but really the best way is to uh, just, you know, just look at uh, Just kind of see where they're coming from. And... Wow, everybody just got destroyed right there. Holy crap, I am freaking rich now. How many coins is that? How many coins is that? F dang. My god, that is freaking death row right there. Like that row right there. Luigi has like two star hacks right there. Pretty dangerous. Probably best to avoid going there. Okay, let's see here. Okay, so War uh, Mario's gonna land right in front of the star. And it looks like the star is worth 30 coins, I think. I think that's the red one. I don't actually know. Okay, I'm definitely not gonna go want to go there. Ooh, nice. Okay, if the, unless, okay, if the star's worth 30, then Mario's gonna have to win the next minigame, but it, I think it's worth 10, actually. I don't actually remember, but it looks like it's worth 10. Okay, this minigame again. Yeah, we've already played this, so. And I think it's the same teams again. Wait, what the hell am I doing? Dang it, now they got the lead. Okay, so come on, keep going up. Ah, dang it, what did I do? Crap, crap, yeah, we lost. Yeah, I screwed that up. I screwed that up. Crap, here's Bowser. We haven't seen you all board, buddy. Alright, what's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? Give me coins. Okay, so he's just gonna take coins. <laughs> well, 20 coins, that would have been a bit too much. Okay, I feel like Wario is definitely gonna get the uh, happening space star if if it actually appears because That's like two times that in a row he landed there All right Mario Okay, okay, I was kind of right I it was 30 coins So the next one should be five Oh wow, I think Oh nice. Okay, that space actually came in handy. I mean, it came in handy for two reasons. One, it put me closer to the star and two, I've really been wanting to get to the item shop just because I want some more damn uh Okay, they don't have star pipes, but I want some more of this. Some more uh blocks or what's it called? Dices. Cause I swear to God, like the boards, like even though the boards are smaller, crap. Uh, 
No! No, I don't want to buy it. I don't.